Pietro Lonhi, born in Venice in 1701, was a prominent painter of contemporary genre scenes. He lived a full life before passing away in 1785. Lonhi was a part of the art movement known as the Rococo period, and his paintings reflected this style with their light colors, soft lines, and emphasis on frivolity. He was also known for his depictions of everyday life, particularly amongst the middle and lower classes, and his works often showcased social interactions and customs of the time. Additionally, Lonhi was fascinated by theater and often painted scenes of actors both on stage and behind the scenes. One of Lonhi's most famous works is The Rhinoceros, which portrays a live rhinoceros that toured through Europe in the mid-18th century. Lonhi painted the rhinoceros as a curious and exotic creature in a scene that features Venetians from different walks of life observing it. This painting not only showcases Lonhi's artistic skill, but also his interest in capturing significant events of his time in his work. Pietro Lonhi, born in Venice in 1701, was the first child of the silversmith Alessandro Falca and his wife Antonia Falca. He was initially taught by the Veronese painter Antonio Balestra and later apprenticed with the Bolognese Giuseppe Maria Crespi. Returning to Venice in the early 1730s, he completed altarpieces and religious themes. His first major work was an altarpiece for the Church of San Pellegrino in 1732, followed by frescoes in C.A. Segreto and the painting of the Death of the Giants. After specializing in small-scale genre works, Lonhi's gallant interior scenes, reflecting the 18th century's turn toward the bourgeois, were extremely popular. In addition to popularizing depictions of everyday life in Venice, Lonhi also painted commission works. This included documenting the seven Catholic sacraments, as Crespi had before him, in the Pinacoteca Carini Stampalia. Lonhi was also director of the Academy of Drawing and Carving from 1763. During this period, he worked extensively with portraiture and was actively assisted by his son, Alessandro. Lonhi's drawings, often in black chalk or pencil, were frequently done for their own sake rather than as studies for paintings. Lonhi died following a short illness on May 8, 1785. Lonhi's work ranged from representations of gambling parlors to depictions of puppet-like figures whose posture and circumstance sometimes suggest a satirical perspective on his subjects. Many genre paintings show Venetians at play and nearly half of the figures in his work are faceless, hidden behind Venetian carnival masks. Among these is the rhinoceros, now on display at the National Gallery in London, which chronicles Clara the Rhinoceros, an animal brought to Europe by a Dutch sea captain and impresario from Leiden, Duvmont van der Meer. Other paintings depict the daily activities of Venetians, such as the Little Concert and the Pharmacist. In conclusion, Pietro Lonhi was a renowned Venetian painter of the Rococo period who skillfully captured the essence of everyday life in his genre scenes. His use of light colors, soft lines, and attention to detail reflected the frivolity and customs of the time. Lonhi's fascination with theater is evident in his paintings, which often portrayed actors both on and off the stage. One of his most famous works, The Rhinoceros, showcased his artistic prowess and interest in documenting significant events of his era. Lonhi's versatility extended beyond genre scenes, as he also excelled in portraiture and served as the director of the Academy of Drawing and Carving. His works, characterized by faceless figures and satirical perspectives, continue to captivate audiences to this day.